Hey guys, and welcome back to XCOM Terror from... Oh, good. Uh, Terror from the Deep, when we last left off. We discovered an alien dreadnought uh, that was napping, and we've managed to capture it. Or at least catch it sitting on its ass. Um, this is cool, but uh, I did look up the fact that we are against Tazuth Commanders. Tazuth Commanders are not the ones we need. It has got to be a lobster man. Oh, he's gone. Yeah, sadly, it has got to be a lobster man, Commander. Um, and actually, we need two of them. So, it does give us free reign to go ham on these guys, which is nice. But it also means that uh, this is not quite the keys to the kingdom we were possibly hoping it to be. But never mind, I suppose. Alright. At least we do have plenty and plenty of these flares. I am concerned about the tentacolants. I know there's about... Oof, Five or six of them, possibly. Possibly a few more. And where we are on the map as well. Uh, we're actually in a really shitty position for them. But if we've got to knock them down with our uh, scout, that is exactly what we're going to do. It doesn't look like there's going to be too much behind us. Okay. So kind of want that up here just to keep us safe. We're going to do a little bit of exploring before we do anything with the scout. Because I'm so paranoid about those tentaclants. I don't want to lose anybody. If that's even possible. But I guess we'll see what we see. Oh. Hello, sir. Oh. Hello, sirs. 28%. You know what? Throw that. Light them up. And you're now stuck outside. That was terrible planning on my part. But you're a rookie, so it's okay. Why can't you hit these guys? Asking for a friend. Well, you hit. Oh, boy. Now, these are the idiots that we've got to get through this mission with. Not impressed. 60%. Kind of want to... Oh, man. Okay, well, uh, mm, you're just kind of hosed. Although, you were put unconscious, so that could have been worse. Hopefully, we can wake him up again. Where are you going? Are you going to attack my tank? Are you seriously going to attack my tank? I think you are. Right, who wants another shot? I guess you do. Uh, you're going to stay out there for now. I want to have a sweep, see if we can find any more tentacle lints. Uh, no tentacle lints, but there is. One of you guys. Make it happen. Really? Ah, uh, oh, high accuracy. High accuracy. And we got the XCOM syndrome. What is going on? Why can't you guys shoot around that corner? Your accuracy is mental. Ah, uh, idiots. Right, well, I mean, you're not going to hit it. 
But we'll put some pressure on this guy anyway. Unbelievable, guys, honestly. <sighs> and they were our heroes. At least one of them was. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Actually, thinking about it, that's not terrible. Kind of. Because we can actually use our tank as a decoy. It actually works quite well. Really? You do realize, guys. Like, if you miss this guy, you're dead. I'm just saying. Like, you're so screwed. If you miss... Okay? You have to kill this guy. <sighs> okay. Okay. God, you guys. Morons. Right, there's him. That's fine. Should we bother with a... I mean, I guess we hit him, I suppose. <clears throat> right. He's gone berserk. Really? He's already gone berserk? I mean, I'm not complaining. I'm actually quite happy about the fact, but damn. I mean, I suppose he has been close by to, like, three of his guys getting wiped out, which probably has an effect on morale. I don't know, for 100% sure, if that affects morale. Being close. Uh, but maybe. 61. Can you give me a hit? Good kill. And you can get back inside. Nice. Happy with that? I will take a couple of good kills. Just let's bloody them up a little bit. I also wouldn't mind to breach there with a disruptor pulse round. I do think that we should have some kind of night vision. I think that's kind of a no-brainer. But I guess the designers thought otherwise. Considering the technology that XCOM has at this point, even if it was a bonus for this high-end... Uh, ooh. This high end, um, actually, forty. That's good. Can you hide? You can. All right. Can you make something good happen? You can. Good man, that man. Okay. Yeah, even if it was like for these high-end ships, uh, these high-end armors, I think they absolutely should have the ability to have some kind of night vision. I believe in one of the um, mods they have night vision. Okay. Definitely want to keep this guy around just to hopefully magnetize some of the tentacle it's out if we can uh what sort of aim have you got on your your arm pretty good okay okay what about you what can we expect from you oh 59 give me a snap that was rubbish uh, okay, that'll work. Ooh. Oh, that's the way to do it, boys. That is the way to do it. I have no idea how many aliens are going to be on here either. I honestly can't remember. I want to say like 20, 30, something like that. Dreadnought. On this difficulty. Uh, 
But so far, so good. I know there's like six tentacoolants. Pot, like, I think it's six to eight tentacoolants. Something crazy. Okay, we've got another alien there. Can anyone? Yes! Oh, <laughs> nice. Oh, no. Nuts. He's outside. Um, well, that's a bastard. Hopefully he'll be okay. I definitely haven't seen the last of the tentaculants, that's for sure. Which is bad, because it means that they're not coming for us. It means they're stuck inside somewhere. I'm not really a fan of that idea. Really not a fan of that idea. Shit, okay, cool. Get back inside. Everybody get another one of these in your hand. Okay. So, I mean, maybe there's not that many of them in here. Because if they're all panicking, then they're dropping their weapons. But, as I said, it's the brains that are really concerning me. Very surprised we can't see any through there. Okay. I just want to leave this over here. Might start getting some guys out. Just slightly. Oh, nice. Uh, actually, go back inside. I'm still not that confident about being out here yet. Although it's nice to see them all panicking, dropping their weapons. We need that. Um, right. I guess we go have a scout. Very tempted to quote pop the top on this thing, or even yeah, blow our way in that way. That that actually might be an idea. Okay, you're not even loaded. Right, launch torpedo. Now be very, very careful. Because we don't want this going wrong. Uh, is that actually even going to impact what we want it to? I don't know. Uh, yeah, that blew a hole in there, alright. Not bad. We have our entry point. Cool. But also, that could have opened the door for tentaculants to slip out. So... Yeah, you can't actually stun this, my friend. I'm sorry to burst your bubble. Right. You. Load up. Come on, Fred. Make it happen, Fred. Be the hero. We know you are, Fred. Oh, this is risky. <laughs> uh, I don't want to lose my... I really don't want to lose that. Again. I mean, should we give it a go? Okay. Uh, right. Yeah, maybe. Uh, you are out of town units. Fred, look the right way, please. Now you're out of town units. Okay. Definitely not. Where are all the tentaculants? This is what I'm not liking here. There's no tentaculants coming at us. There should be. You're just wasting your ammo, dude. You really are. I 
I'm so freaking concerned about this. Right. Fire. Oof. Straight out the door. Straight line, please. Up. Yeah. Straight out the door. Up. Boing. Boing. Boom. Solid kill. Good work, Fred. And <laughs> no wonder he's got a grin like that. Fucking champion. Alright. Ah, uh, however, we have just disconnected this now. Maybe there aren't that many um, tentacoolants in here. I mean, I doubt it. There's probably freaking hundreds. Ooh. Where? Ah. Okay. Fred? Are you ready? You got one racked, Fred? You got one racked. Ready, Fred? This is all on you, me brother. Right, fire that round. Can we get here? And then here. And then, like, here. And connect. Now, unfortunately, that's opened the door for them. Uh, so, maybe park you there. We're going to have to get some guys out defensively. Ready to hit any tentacle bastards that decide they want to come and fuck our lives up. Keep high. To avoid a uh, pulse detonator launcher. Z. At least as high as you can, anyway. Can't do miracles here. Right. See if we can draw out the, the brains with our delicious, yummy, warm bodies. Doesn't look like it, though. Okay, nothing yet. Alright, let's get these going. Throw. Light the way, men. Light the way. Or women. Because you appear to have... Ooh, nice. You appear to have female... Pieces. Alright, let's go. Let's get Team Rocket out. No, I like Hammer Bros. These are the Hammer Bros. It's like the Hammer of Dawn. Ooh. We have a panicked soldier down there. We're going to go blaster his ass in a minute. Oof. You, sir, have the pulse detonation weapon. Is there a safe way I can get some shots on at you? No. No, there isn't. So. Yep. I hate to use my tank at times because then our soldiers don't get the XP, but at the same time, they don't, you know, die. At least that's the theory. Alright, let's start spreading people out. In the hope that more guns pointed in that direction is a good thing. Okay. Okay, so. Yeah, I thought you might run, you sniveling turd. So even if we get one of these commanders, they're actually quite useless to us, sadly. You can see him. Aim shot 42. No, you can't. Aim shot 30, maybe. No. Uh, see if you can bring him down. 
Again, I hate to use this because they don't get the XP, but I'd rather get the alien killed than lose men. Without a doubt. Ooh. Ooh. Can I get... Oh, it's going to be you again, isn't it? A snapshot. That's a hell of a shot, though. And if we blast the bomb these guys, we're going to lose a lot of equipment. Yep. Okay, that worked. That worked. Ooh. That was nice. Yes. That's it. Present your bodies. Alright, okay, cool. What have we got in here? Some tentacles would be nice. Okay, right. These guys. Get ready. You're going to move in on that side. I want some volunteers. You two. You're going to move in in the middle. I didn't say it was a pleasant job or even a safe job, but it needs to be done. And you guys. Oof. Uh, you guys can start thinking about dropping down this way. And you get you in the air. You don't have many rounds left, Red, but. Because you guys are an extra pair of eyes. Now, the fact they're going berserk and not firing their weapons probably means that they have blaster bomb launchers. Or disruptor pulse weapons. Because you don't get blaster bombs in this game. Okay. Right, well, quite good. Mm hmm, mm hmm, I like it. Nice. I mean, I say I like it, I don't really like it. This is a little sketch. And by saying little sketch, it's actually very sketch. Can we go in there? I can't remember. Cobe, you need to watch your ass. Because you are a really good soldier. And I don't want to lose you. To be honest. So hopefully you, up there, you're going to keep these guys safe. Can you throw? You can, oh, that's the edge of the map there. This map isn't that big. Cool. Ooh. That's okay. You can become unconscious. That's fine. Kind of defeats our invasion force slightly, but not enough time units. Where did that? Oh, that came from up there. So have we blown away? Yes. We've blown away right into that. Let's see if we can abuse that in a minute. Hang on. And I have no idea how long it's going to be before those guys. Oh, hey. <laughs> no idea how long it's going to be before these guys... Um, wake up again, if at all, might actually have to get them some kind of aid. Right. Now, if anything comes through there, you're going to have to really cover their ass, guys. Uh, actually, let's, you know what? Let's have a three-man squad going this way. Okay. 
You guys can move up. I really wish I had more men. But the tank is such a useful platform. There is a lot of guys up here still. Oof. Guys, kill it. Thank you. Alright, you upstairs. What do you see? Well, not much up there, to be honest. Um, right. Uh, okay. Yeah, you can't go in there, can you? Shit. I thought there was another way in here. But without blowing it open, I guess there isn't. We could drop a hammer on the top, blow a way open that way, which we could actually very much do. Uh... I'm hoping that's not going to destroy our sub. Well, that's you know what I don't really care. We've we've got the resources to build another one. No, it did not. Okay, so you boys. Can go in the top. I have a horrible feeling. We've just opened the floodgates for tentaculants. But, I guess. <laughs> I guess we shall see. I guess we shall see. So, and if these two idiots ever wake up, hmm, we can sort something out here too. Right, good stuff. Good show. Good show. All right. Happy? Who can you see and what can you see? Oh, you can see him. Can't quite hit him though. Just get there. He's not armed. If you go there, you'll have 47. So that'll give you 30. Can't. Yeah. Now you can see him. Okay. Oh. Where's he going? He's coming down to say hello. Hmm. Where did he go? There he goes. Right, let's go hunt this guy. Hopefully, if he's going to throw anything, he'll throw it at the tank. Because uh, I don't know how the AI works. I don't know if the AI sees, oh, that enemy's a tank. Or if it just sees it as an enemy. No, he's just going to run past. That's fine. Okay. Okay, cool. We're good. We're good. Where is that guy? Ah, oh, fuck, it could be anywhere. Okay. Not great. It's panicked up there again. We'll take it. Oh, that's a tentacle. But. Yeah, 
interesting thing about that is it was attacking us from like a tile away. I didn't think they could do that. So we're going to bunker in there because I reckon there's more. <laughs> Right, cool. Who can you see? You can see him. Gotta kill him. No point, like, doing shit like that. Well, I mean, yeah, I kind of got the right idea. Ah, oh, crap. Oof. <laughs> Mistakes have been made, I think. No, he's gone berserk. That's okay. Nope. We did make mistakes, but lucky. We weren't given the usual harsh XCOM punishment for it. Now, where the frick these tentacles are, I have no idea. But hopefully, we've at least got most of them. Okay. All right. It's a sketch. Anything? Nothing yet. Because it's so dark, you just don't know. That's the worrying thing. We know this is a room they do like to hide in. Now, Tula, I'm going to want you to lock that down. I also want, really, I want to get some more guys. I want some more eyes. Is there anyone we've forgotten about? No. No, there isn't. Okay, I don't think there's many left, actually. Like, really don't think there's many left. Which is good. But I've got a feeling they're probably down here. I mean, there's definitely one guy that's not accounted for. Maybe you can go explore down here? Or explore out the ship? Still in there panicking. Okay. I guess not. Right. Okay. Oh, we're on 34 minutes. Well, it could be in one of these. So, as we're on 34 minutes, guys, uh, I'm going to save this hit. This has been quite a fun mission, actually, but now we've got to play Hunt the Alien. And if we do get all that ZR bite, I'm going to be a happy chap indeed. But playing Hunt the Alien is not my favourite game in the world. It's 
especially on a freaking ship like this. Oh. You mean no line of fire? Oh, come on. What was that? Misclick. Yeah, I know he's there. Okay. Well, I mean... He'll have 40. Can you hit him? Yes. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Talk about ending it there. We've actually just finished the mission. Oh, we got 150. That was amazingly done, actually. Um, well, <laughs> that sounds like I'm sucking my own dick there. But, I mean, that was really lucky. That went really well. 19 aliens. 18 corpses. Artifacts recovered. One. You've got a lot of shit. Look at the ZR bite we got as well. Okay. And a lot of aquaplastics. Lots of uh, skill ups for people as well. All right. Okay, so we took a, a that wasn't a dreadnought, was it? It's a supply, heavy supply, fleet supply cruiser, I believe. And that was good. That went really freaking well, guys. Um, but we are going to go back to base and we are going to sell everything because otherwise I will forget in the next video. Ooh. Really? You want to fuck with us? Go on then. He's going to get well away, isn't he? No. We're going to take him out? He's gone. Get the hell out of here. Right, so, uh, sell sack. Let's see what we've got. We've got so much. Um, oh my god. Sonic cannons. They're not using a lot of sonic cannons, are they? But they all seem to have the disruptor pulse launchers, which is concerning. And sell some of the thermal shock. We've got a lot of thermal shock ammo, too, which is actually really good. Sell all of those. We have 436 ZR bytes. This, of course, is fantastic. Uh, uh -huh. Iron beam accelerators. Then we need these, actually, for our subs. Yeah, the mantas, because we are going to need more mantas. The thing is, like, a manta will pretty much always use um, its 50 fuel when it goes out to intercept. So... Yeah, I mean, you you can just see how insane that actually is. But there we go. We made another four odd million. So I'm going to leave it there, guys. Thank you very much for watching. And as always, till next time.